um, adversity. You, um, Coach Harson said it. That was a big thing. Um, Jacksonville to Tallahassee, things like that. Hotel to hotel. Kids from Cali coming to Florida, the heat. But adversity was a big word, and that's what we used to get through this. Robert, what did you guys learn from your freshman quarterback today? What, what, what he dealt with out there? So he's tough. You see, he takes some hits. He got right back up like he's nothing. So he's a tough guy. You know, uh, he's only going to get better. He's only a freshman, so I'm excited for him. How much of what you guys did, uh, like you had 60, you think it was 61 plays in the first half. Did you guys feel like you wore down FSU's defense? Oh, yeah, definitely. Half? I feel like, uh, you know, ground and pound, we wore them down. In the second half, they got tired. We were tired also, but, you know, that's what we do is we run the ball here, so we wore them down. What, Eric, what was it like for you? you? You come out here, set the high school record for most field goals in the game. And coming from D3 school <laughs> to playing at Florida State and winning and being part of this win, what's that like for you? Um, I mean, I don't think it's really set in. Uh, I mean, I just took it all in. Uh, each snap, just being able to look around. Um, yeah, just going out there, doing my job, and obviously the people around me made it a lot easier. You got Kyle holding, and everything was perfect from Danny and him. And you got the big guys up front. Just, I mean, I saw, I saw no maroon jerseys in front of me all day, so. Makes my job pretty easy. You got a guy, a group of guys that love each other. When you got a group of guys that love each other, they'll never count us out. You know what I'm saying? So we just fought and we fight. We just fight for all four quarters and good things that happen. I believe it was Tuesday or Monday. Came in, we had a little team meeting. Harson played the seven minute highlight video of the Kellen Moore team playing Virginia Tech. And just seeing like what our tradition has in the past and like what they've done. It just made us like feel more confident and feel like we have to keep that going. When you talk about this game years down the road, how are you going to explain how you guys came back from 18 down on the road at Florida State? I don't. I, I can't even describe. I got to think about that tonight. <laughs> yeah, I got to think about that tonight. I'll get back to you. <laughs> we're tough. We have grit. Um, we believe in what we're doing. We believe in the coaches. Um, I can't tell you like things that happened in the game or certain stats that we had because, you know, it was a long, tough, exhausting game, but I just knew that the next play mattered most. And I think that's kind of the whole team's mentality. <laughs> we, we just spent so much time uh, preparing for this game. And for us to just waste it uh, just didn't make sense to us. We wanted to, to do the most. We wanted to, you know, play as a team and see what we could actually do and um, it turned out in our favor. At the end of the day, the, the first half, it was tough, right? But we knew, like, if, if we were going to just, you know, fall over, it would have been an embarrassment. Uh, so we knew as an offensive line, that's who I could speak for, that we needed to go out this drive and make something happen. And because if we didn't make something happen, it was going to get worse. So at, at the end of the day, our mentality was still fast and physical. It was still running the ball to win. Um, nothing changed. We believed in Hank no matter what. Um, in, our, in our receiving core and tight ends and running backs. So it, it was kind of just being consistent was key.